what I did not know then that I wish that I had known is to go to every orientation program that you possibly could. I mean, there's a lot of them that are offered for first year students at the beginning when you're first starting. Um, go to everything that you can. There's so much information in there and it's, it's just a great way to meet people. It's a great way to feel comfortable on campus. What I wish I knew then that I know now is to take advantage of all the in-house scholarships that Concordia has to offer as well as the uh, scholarships they can get elsewhere through your work that you've done at Concordia. I wish I knew about the co-op program beforehand. I joined in my second year of studies and if I've done that earlier it uh, would have uh, saved me some trouble, let's say. In my first year I wish I had known the diversity of courses available to me so that I could have explored uh, different options. And I, I did, but um, I would have done that a lot more. My main advice would be go to class and read the textbook, <laughs> which is, was essentially what I did to get me through um, every single course that I took and it really worked well for me. Always take notes, no matter what the class is, no matter what the professor is. It's not high school or CJEP anymore. Uh, university is a whole different ball game. It's important to uh, stay on top of your readings. Always, uh, if you need help, there are always the TAs and the uh, and the professor himself. If you go to the classes and you really pay attention and get involved in the courses that you're taking, you pay off so much. Exams are so much easier. The assignments are so much easier, and you just have a much better time bonding with your classmates and with the teachers. If you have, for example, a job. Don't take a full-time uh, study here in Concordia, take it part-time. Uh, the thing that helped me in my first year and that's, that has also helped me through my graduate studies was actually attending the Discover Concordia and start right uh, because I was given a lot of information. When I first started here, uh, what I did is uh, I attended the, the, the workshop from Gasoline Development and they, ha they give out the handouts and strategy how to make group work and how to make presentation. Make yourself aware of the actual resources that are available at the university. The health, centers, the health services are great, the counseling services are great, the academic counselors are great. Definitely know about the Student Success Center. Uh, it, it's a center where you have mentors that are all students, so we've all gone through whatever they're going through. And it's just a nice place to know because you can come to us, ask a question, or even if you just want to come and chat, we're there for that. University is not about study only, it's about uh, life and making friends and networking. You can be whoever you want to be in university, that's the good thing. So if you're a sociable person, you can join any type of social association you can. You, there's sports, there's entertainment, there's anything you want. Talk to people. Um, you know, these, these are your peers and they're there to help you and they're the ones that are going to get you through the day in the end and through the years. So just, you know, be social and really just go out there and have fun. Never give up. I mean, if, it, if you hit a wall like I did when I came back in my 40s, I actually wasn't accepted into my program. I did a year as independent study, reapplied, doing great now. So don't give up. If you hit a wall, talk to people, there's always a way to do it.